Okay, now we're going to add our new domain to HostGator. And what you'll do is you go to uh, you'll go into HostGator, you'll go to the dashboard, which is here, go all the way close to the bottom, you'll find domains and you'll add, you'll click add on domains. Okay. And your new domain name is Paul Snyder dot info. Okay, and now it'll have a check mark and you'll click somewhere, just anywhere, it doesn't matter, any of those spaces, and it'll automatically add this right here, this line and this line. Everything's okay. Um, we'll add a password. Now you can either do a password generator right there, or, and sometimes these are real long, hard to, um, really difficult to remember, so I usually don't. I just put in a password that I can remember. Just be sure to, first of all, be sure that they, they match. Secondly, be sure that you put it in a place that you can remember it and um, that we uh, they all can get back into it. So then you just add domain. As it's setting up here. As soon as... Uh -oh. Okay, I did add it earlier. Um, okay, it's just saying, yeah, it, it was added on. That's fine. Okay, what we'll do now is we're going to go back, and I want to show you where it's added. There it is, right there, so that's fine. Um, we're going to cut this short here, and on the next video, we'll come back, and I want to show you how to set up your database for adding a um, WordPress blog. And that's what we'll do next. We'll see you in the next video.